Sunglow Canyon is a short technical canyon in south central Utah. It's conveniently located close to Sunglow Campground in Fish Lake National Forest. It makes a suitable afternoon or evening objective before settling into camp for the toasting of marshmallows. The nearest town is Bicknell and it's located perfectly for a trip to or from Capitol Reef National Park. Sunglow is a quiet small campground. A couple of sites can be reserved online while the other four are a first come first served basis. Sunglow Canyon has two forks, west and east. I descended the west fork which is shorter, taking less time. The approach hike takes about an hour, ascending Crescent Creek, the valley to the west. The trail is a bit overgrown going up Crescent Creek. I guess the wet winter helped everything grow. Ah, there's a trail marker. There are nice views from the ridge top, but there was rain in the air, so I kept moving. I'll follow the trail till I can see the wash and then I'm heading in now. I could have gone in a few minutes earlier probably. The slot begins and ends abruptly. It rained overnight. There was rain further in the air, looking a few miles away, but I should be quick, I'm solo. There's a nasty looking cloud there, but I could tell it's gonna miss. <laughs> and suddenly, out of nowhere, there's a rappel. Wow, that happened quick. Anchors here. The first rappel is just over 10 meters, about 40 feet. On the approach hike, there was clearly rain in the air approaching. Given the slot is short and I was alone, moving quickly and efficiently, I was confident I could travel through the slot before the rain reached. This rappel, slung boulder, second drop. I hand over hand did the second drop, maybe 20 feet. Nice little corridor. Bolted anchor, I think it's three bolts. The third and drop is about 10 meters. That was the third rappel, down into the pool, walked around that. Short corridor, bolted anchor, down to a bit of a pothole, with an anchor on the left. Looking back up at the fourth rappel, down into this pool, it was quite slippery to get out of. Not a keeper, but a little bit worried there for a while with all the silt on my shoes. And then here's the anchor. The fourth rappel is the most spectacular, down into a chamber and pothole on the edge of a precipice. The rain reached the canyon as I was on the final rappel. It's an easy angled 30 meters, 100 feet rappel. The canyon opens immediately below the final rappel. Take off your harness and rest a while, admiring the surrounding cliffs. And then looking out, definitely looking rainy out there. <coughs> looking back up. It's about half a mile down the wash back to camp. You'll need to climb around and over boulders in parts. Once back in camp, you've earned the reward of a campfire and marshmallows. Blueberry, of course. It's nice like a cuddle. <laughs> Sunglow Canyon and Campground are a great setting for an afternoon and evening, before or after a visit to Capitol Reef National Park.